priority registration, it's one step at a time. Orientation, assessment, and educational planning. It gives you that sense of direction, it gives you that foundation. It made it very difficult for me to fail. Having the priority registration made me realize the steps that I needed to take in order to be successful. When you complete those steps, you have a greater uh, understanding of what you're going to have to go through to achieve your goal. And that's really what it's about. Uh, these, these steps are about completing your goals. During orientation, they show you how to register for classes, where to drop classes, pay for classes. Doing it online really helped me understand where I could go if I had questions, where I could go if I needed something. You'd set up an appointment for a placement test. It's not a pass or fail, it's just see what level math or English you're currently at. Even if you're at the lowest point in the math or the English, I think it's better to have a recipe for success. So you don't get placed into a class that you're not ready for. I know that if I hadn't had to take those classes in math where the assessment had placed me, I wouldn't have had the tools or the skills to pass a college level math class. Having an educational plan was awesome because I'm a visual learner. I like to see everything in a picture, like right in front of me. It gives you a vision of what you're going to take, what you're going to learn. You figured out enough what you want to do, what you're interested in, and where your priorities lie. You have to choose your classes earlier, and in choosing your classes, you set your priorities. I mean, I thought that this time would last forever, and all of a sudden, this is my last semester. There's going to be a lot of things that you don't want to do, but this is absolutely necessary, and you are going to be so grateful that you did it.